It's all today, live from the couch. Well, now we're going to keep it going with master pastry chef Jacques Torres. He's here with holiday treats to delight the family. We see cookies. We want cookies. Well, the holidays mean a lot of decorating, shopping, and getting together with friends. So let's not forget eating, eating, eating. And what's better than those great holiday desserts that only come around once a year? We're joined by master pastry chef and Mr. Chocolate himself, Jacques Torres, to show us some of his favorite holiday treats. Welcome. Thank you for Thank coming you. in. We cannot Bonjour. wait to get started. Bonjour. Bonjour. So let's start with your special recipe that you brought okay. for us today. So those are chocolate chips cookies made with macadamia. Okay. I toast the macadamia. And then the, the way to make them is very simple. Always the same for cookies. Soft butter. Butter, add the sugar, mm -hmm. mix mm -hmm. everything together, add the eggs, like every cookies, mm -hmm. mix everything together, then all the dry ingredients. And then at the end, you put the nuts, you just mix it, um, not too much, you don't want to, to develop too much the gluten. Okay. Then when everything is mixed, then you're going to boil them. So, of course, with clean hands, mm -hmm. yes. you make some little bowl, put them into And you the leave tray. them like that. And you leave them the, like that. The and mm -hmm. they're just going to come uh, flat. And this you, is... You like big cookies. I like big cookies. <laughs> you like you know? big cookies. Well, if you're going to have a cookie, have a big one. If you indulge, go all the way or I don't do it. You. You know, yeah. That's yeah. And it's like, and it's the saying, if you're going to have chocolate, have great chocolate if you're going to have important. it. This is important. I don't use baking chocolate. I use the same chocolate that I will use in my uh, chocolate boxes. So it's high hand and you can really taste it. So so the deal with that is when you have those cookies, mm -hmm. you break them in half mm -hmm. and you can dip them in milk. It's right. fine. But I love to dip them into port. Being 27, it's a ruby mm. port. You don't have to drink it because the cookie drink actually the port. Okay. okay. And I then, can drink it. The and then you know what? And it. then you eat the cookies. I like your and style. And I promise you, okay. it's delicious. Be careful. Ooh. So ahead, this is a new way of eating the cookies, but I promise you, you enjoy it so much. Well, Jacques, traditionally, people would wow. dip their cookie in milk. Yes. And that's what, and so and how did you come up with this in, twist? In, in Europe, mm. biscotti are always dip into sweet wine. Really? So those cookies work very well. The, um, the macadamia, the, the, the buttery flavor go well with uh, bean 27. We also have a, a, a competition a cookie competition, Cookie Rumble. That's, we're going to announce the winner tomorrow, and um, it's a it's a comp it's a national uh, competition. And uh, I hope that next year you guys are going to compete. And I can do the cookies with you. We're going to win, okay? We're going to have a team. Oh, we'll we're totally going to win. win. We'll totally win. I apologize. We're all being very quiet because these are so delicious. And <laughs> Thank the you. combination the is The combination, excellent. I was a little reluctant, but it does work. Oh, it's, it's no. Good, this huh? is it's amazing. Good, yes. yeah. and, and you, you have to dip them. You have to oh, dip them. Oh, yeah. And yeah. Well, I promise you. Leave them in a while, Soak it. too. Yeah. Deep. Bite. My yeah. tongue is numb right now. <laughs> <laughs> so is my brain. <laughs> so what else do we have here? Jody's holding a little snowman. And I have some of my holiday uh, favorites here. A little snowman. We have different with dark chocolate, with white chocolates. Uh, of course, our cookies and some goodies. My chocolate boxes here. And, uh, you know, a lot of the, good, the goodies pardon, that we produce uh, in my manufacture. The packaging is so beautiful, too. That's really Thank part you. of the gift. Thank you very much. You know, the holidays are here, so we try to do a little bit more of that. But again, the cookies are always uh, a big winner. And especially if you put them a little bit in the oven before you serve them, then the chocolate is going to be very melty. When you cut them, you see that chocolate oozing. That's yeah. really good this Well, I, I'll tell you what the winner <laughs> is. The winner is showing up at someone's house with this as a hostess gift because I've done that before. And people just love it. They use it as decoration, and then after, they'll eat it. Oh, can I ask you a question? Of course. So if I, if you take this as a hostess gift, when do you need to eat it? How long will this last? Okay, chocolates, dark chocolates last for a very long time, almost a year. Do they need to oh, be wow. refrigerated? Though? No, they don't. They can stay at room temperature. Milk and white chocolate less than six months. But the best way to store chocolates it's in your stomach. I agree. Basically, chocolate uh, okay. is not wine. Chocolate is not pork. I am listening to you right now. I'm <laughs> storing this chocolate as we speak in my stomach. This so is this, great. Is, this is what's going on. You know, you don't you don't age chocolates. You eat, eat it, it, enjoy it, eat <laughs> it, and come to buy more. That's usually the deal. <laughs> so what do you do for the holidays? You're cooking all year long. Do you cook for Christmas? Yes, I will cook for Christmas. But usually, what I do, we work so hard during the holiday that right after, I take a little vacation. The first week of January, oh. you know, I usually go. Away. But now it's really where we have the most uh, the most business. About 40% of what we do all year happen during Christmas. Wow. So all the chocolate maker don't really spend uh, time 
out during vacation, during uh, yeah. Christmas, during yeah. that holiday. It's hard work for you. It's, it's hard work. Any new plans for next year? Any new uh, ideas yes. you're working on? I just uh, opened uh, two pop-up and I'm opening two more stores, one on 57th Street between Park and Lexington. Wow. Close to us. What we a neighborhood. That. One <laughs> on Lafayette Street and one on Grand Central uh, Station. I'm also going to have a store there. So we are really expanding. I just opened a big manufacturer, chocolate manufacturer, in some Sunset Park. So that's great. That's going to be, you know, the, the chocolate manufacturer of New York. So I have to come and here the more and see what they're doing. I'll be expanding too. No, no, I say <laughs> please keep doing what you're doing because we'll Thank keep you. eating it. You know? Thank you and the much. macadamia nuts are toasted before you put them in, which makes yes. them extra crunchy mm -hmm. and delicious. Right. We put a little bit of sugar around, we toast them, and then we put them into the, the, the cookies. Otherwise, they don't have time to roast. This is why. Right. Amazing. And you taste it. I mean, thank you, really you so much. Thank great. you. Thank, thank you for having you. me. Merci, and thank you for making our morning a little bit sweeter you can go to mrchocolate.com to find out where you can buy these amazing treats c'est c'est bon merci beaucoup amazing thank you so much thank you. well now uh coming up tomorrow